what's up guys doing a little trail riding this morning and I ran across this in the wood so I went back to the house grabbed my little trailer with some tools and some gas and I'm gonna see if this thing will fire up so I stole the battery off the mud mower here got my trailer with all my tools and gas and a little battery powered air pump all right got the battery installed in this old thing let's go ahead and check the oil before we try to fire it up i didn't put gas in it yep looks like we got oil let's see if this thing will actually fire up without touching the carburetor zero compression is blowing fire everywhere so I guess I'm going to have to take this home, try to drag it out the woods and pull the head off and see if I can figure out if there's a head gasket or not. Well, I got it home now. Rather than checking the head gasket and all, I have a swamp of engines in my shed already. So I'm going to go grab one. I'm just going to go ahead and swap another motor out and see how the training works. And if everything works good, then I guess we'll be doing a pulley swap on it here soon. So now I'll just put this motor in the shed and when I get a chance I'll take it down and see if I can figure out if it's just a head gasket or a bad rings or whatever. If it's just a head gasket I'll get a new one and get it back running. Alright, got the pulley off, got everything unhooked, got the engine unbolted. Now I'm about to pull this bad boy off and go grab one out of my shed, decide which one I want to put on. I have one with a pull start already with the whole setup on so I might just put that one on there. So let me go pick the engine and pull this one off and I'll be back. So this is the engine I decided to go with being that it had a pull start set up already on it. So I guess now let's just see if this thing gonna fire up. Got everything hooked up. So try and see what happens. Well, we got it running. Turns out it wasn't the carburetor that was bad. The intake had a crack. So I had another one laying around, so I went grab it, changed it all out. I was able to set the fuel mixture that I needed to be. That's why I couldn't get it early in the earlier video. But uh, I got it going now, so let's see how she runs and drives.
there you have it, running and driving. So, a quick pull of swap and wet her in, and this thing will be ready to hit the trails.